Have you ever had a bad experience with your bank? Then you're definitely not alone. Most people tend to sign up for banks that are close to their house or just one of the big traditional banks in your country. Luckily, we're living in the digital era where you usually have a bunch of different fintech apps to choose from, usually offering better benefits, sign up bonuses, and just way better customer satisfaction. Today, we'll take a closer look at Revolut, which is one of the biggest, if not the biggest fintech apps in the world. Revolut acts as a one-stop shop for everything finance, offering everything from free bank accounts, multiple different debit card options, smart budgeting features, cryptocurrency trading, and even stock trading as well. And if you do want to sign up for Revolut, you can do so for free by using the link down in the video description. First off, let's cover the different plans that you can get over at Revolut. Revolut comes in four different plans. You have the standard account, which is completely free of charge, but you also have the plus, premium and a metal account, which all comes at a monthly cost, but also with some additional benefits. The standard account will essentially cover everything you need in terms of banking, nothing too fancy, but at the end of the day, it is a completely free service to use. You still get access to most of the features within the app, plus the ability to make international bank transfers, great overseas exchange rates, and of course, the very simple but unique looking debit card. Now the plus account on the other hand will cost you three pounds a month or about 30 pounds a year now i'll be talking about pounds in this video but obviously if you want to see the prices in your local currency just head over to the revolut website and you can see all the prices in your local currency as well now, the plus account comes with all the benefits of the standard account plus some additional protections such as a 1000 pound accident protection cover that is valid for a whole year after the moment that you make a purchase so if you ever end up getting the latest iphone and crack the screen two minutes later all right, we're doing the reveal. His name's Jack. You can simply jump into the app and make a claim for that specific damage and get a refund for your purchase. On top of this, the Plus account also comes with a 90 day return window where you can easily get refunded for any purchases between 50 pounds and 300 pounds even though the retailer doesn't technically accept returns. On top of this, you also have the ticket cancellation protection. So if you can't make it to the Taylor Swift concert, Revolut will reimburse you for any ticket purchase up to 1,000 pounds. As for savings, you can get up to 0.65% annual interest paid daily nothing major but still higher than what most other traditional banks would offer finally the revolut plus account will also allow you to customize and personalize your debit card you get so you can add emojis to it or write something on it makes your card a bit more personalized so that's a nice extra feature to have the premium account on the other hand will come in a more sleek looking card and will cost you about eight pounds a month or 72 pounds a year and comes with all of the previous benefits plus some extra benefits mostly useful for frequent travelers now first off it comes with an added smart delay feature this will essentially give you free airport lounge access if your flight is ever delayed by more than an hour so the next time you'll be traveling you'll be wishing that your flight is delayed it also comes with unlimited foreign exchange and atm withdrawal boost which means you can spend, exchange, and transfer unlimited amounts of money within the interbank exchange rate and also withdraw up to 400 pounds for free when you're overseas. On top of this, you also get virtual cards, which are useful to use for one-off purchases or if you're signing up for a subscription service. Now, lastly in the lineup, we have the heavily sought after metal card. This will run you about 14 pounds a month or 120 pounds a year. Now, the metal account will not only give you a silky smooth looking metal card, but will also get you the added benefits of 1% cash back on all your purchases made on the card. On top of this, most of the previous benefits and limits are also increased with a metal subscription. So for example, your previous 400 pound limit on ATM withdrawals is now increased to 800 pounds and the smart delay feature will now get you airport lounge access for you, but also up to three friends as well. Now over to the app in general, one of the most beloved features on Revolut is its multi-currency account. This essentially allows you to hold, transfer and exchange money in over 24 foreign currencies, allowing you to hold and manage these multiple different currencies from one single app. Now this is super useful if you're traveling or if you're just living abroad in a different country because you can still have your native currency in one account and then you can have your new currency in the other. The app also comes with some great benefits such as the bill splitting feature, allowing you to easily split bills with friends on the go, so no need to sit with the calculator after your next night out. Another feature I like over at Revolut is its smart budgeting, and it's fairly similar to what you've seen on Monzo. This feature will automatically categorize your spending in real time based on the type of purchases you make. So all of your spending on the card will be automatically sorted based on the type of purchase that you make, 
whilst all of this data then collected and then visualized so you can get a better overview of your spending habits. And if you have a bad habit of going crazy over the weekends, the app is perfect because it allows you to set limits on your spending so you can't overspend based on the limits that you set directly in the app. If you're like me, having a way to actually track your spending is not only great, but it's also a good way to help you find ways to cut down your spending in certain areas. And also the insights in the app itself also just makes this 10 times easier. Finally, if you love personal finance and investing, then Revolut has you covered with its cryptocurrency trading and stock trading built in directly in the app. The app currently offers over 30 different digital currencies, which you can easily buy, sell, and send at the touch of a button without fees as well, up to 200,000 pounds a month. Now their stock trading is not available in the US. Maybe this is something that will come in the future. But stock trading at this point is very competitive with commission-free trades within your allowance that is also increased based on your subscription level. Now, all of this is super convenient because if you currently have one app for cryptocurrency trading, maybe you have one for stocks, one for banking, one for budgeting, all of this will just be turned into one. So it will make your life 10 times easier and also clean up your phone at the same time. As you probably noticed by now, Revolut does not only offer great benefits, but it also offers plenty of unique features available to both free and paying users on the app. Its analytics and budgeting and spending limits can also help you manage your finances directly in the app while you get somewhat competitive interest on your savings. And as if that was not enough, Revolut also hit us with a free cryptocurrency trading as well as the options to trade commodities such as stocks at a competitive rate while also doing it all within the same app. All in all, I do really like the Revolut app and I do understand why a lot of people are giving it good reviews online and it really just has a good reputation overall. Now at this point, you might be thinking, okay, I wanna get Revolut, but what card should I get? And as always, as I usually say, it will depend on your spending habits. If you think you'll be using a lot of the paid features within the app, such as the increased limits on fee-free stock trading, the low foreign exchange rates, overseas ATM withdrawals, or the 1% cashback, then you will have to make a decision based on the features that you actually want to get. So for example, if you don't travel that much, the Plus account will do you really well because it covers all of the basics but nothing extra that you're not gonna use anyway. However, if you are a frequent traveler and don't mind spending a little bit more for some extra benefits, then obviously going for the premium account will be a great fit. Now lastly, if you are a frequent traveler and you're a heavy spender and you want to use the cryptocurrency and the commodity trading, then going with a metal account is definitely gonna be the best fit for you. And if you do want to sign up for Revolut, you can do so by using the link down in the video description. And if you enjoyed this type of content, please make sure to leave a like and also subscribe so you don't miss out on any other of my reviews here on the channel. That is it for me. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the very next video. Woo!